Oh, hello, this is Tak Chong from Walk with Tak, and welcome to my YouTube channel. If you enjoyed this video, please like, subscribe, and share. I recently received this comment from a viewer. He said, uh, I have been using a carbon steel wok to cook for years, but with a wooden spoon. Uh, I just purchased a standard steel wok spatula, and it totally scratched up the wok. Uh, maybe I brought the wrong one. Uh, can you link one you like? Uh, in regard to this question as well as the comment, uh, I decided I'm going to do a video to explain what happens when you use a standard steel wok spatula in woks with natural surfaces. Uh, this will include woks that make from carbon steel, cast iron, light cast iron, as well as standard steel. A wok with natural surfaces means that they have no non-stick coating. And in this, this type of cooked surfaces, in order to create a non-stick cooked surface, uh, you use the method of seasoning, uh, which is by heating the cooking oil in the wok uh, to the temperature that they will form a polymer on the surface. And this will coat the surface of the wok and uh, prevent food from sticking and burning to it. Uh, there are many ways to season a wok with natural surface to create a non-stick cooked surface. I use a method called spot seasoning, uh, which allows you to season the wok in about 15 to 30 seconds before you cook each time. As you can see here with this seasoning method, uh, I can cook an egg in almost any type of woks without the egg sticking and burning to the surface of the wok. Uh, here is an example of a carbon steel wok that has been seasoned with this method. Uh, here is another example to uh, demonstrate how it works with a standard steel wok. Uh, this method works equally well uh, with cast iron cooked surface. A wok with natural surface uh, could not be damaged by metal spatula because there is nothing for it to be damaged, as in contrast with a uh, wok with non-stick coating. A non-stick coating could be easily scratched by metal objects. Therefore, if you have cookware with a non-stick coating, uh, you have to use something that is relatively soft, such as wood or plastic. However, even when you use this type of uh, spatula, it could still damage the non-stick coating eventually. So when this viewer uh, wrote to me, and told me that when he used a standard steel wok spatula, he discovered that it scratched up his carbon steel wok. Uh, there are two reasons for this might happen. Uh, the first reason is that his carbon steel wok might have non-stick coating. In fact, many carbon steel wok actually come with non-stick coating, as shown in this case of this Emusa 14-inch carbon steel wok. Uh, in this case, the standard steel wok spatula definitely cause damage to the non-stick coating. Uh, the second reason is that some of the wok come with what is known as pre-seasoning. Uh, this Emusa 14-inch light cast iron wok is an example of such pre-seasoning. Uh, pre-seasoning is usually is a vegetable oil resin of food grade quality uh, means that you can eat it without causing harm. A manufacturer usually uses this resin to coat the surface of the wok uh, to prevent the wok from rusting during shipping. Uh, this vegetable resin has the same property uh, in seasoning the wok when you use cooking oil. Uh, so when you first use the wok, the wok performs like a wok has non-stick coating. However, in time, like any type of seasoning, uh, this vegetable resin seasoning will wear off. As you will notice that the wok no longer have the non-stick property when you first got it. Uh, this could be very puzzling for most people because they thought their wok come with non-stick coating, uh, with the vegetable resin that will last for a long time. Uh, I have many people who told me that they were confused and they thought they have damaged the wok and they gave up using the wok. At this point, all you have to do is to re-season the wok, uh, such as using my spot seasoning method each time before you cook. And this will restore the non-stick property of the wok. The third possibility in this case are uh, if a person has used the wok for a long time, the woks tend to build up a brown coloration, uh, which frequently is known as 
patina. Uh, the patina is a layer of oxidation that happens on the surface of the wall and create staining. The patina, in fact, has nothing to do with the seasoning of the wok. Uh, because I can season a wok that is uh, perfectly clean and spotless, uh, using my spot seasoning method to create a non-stick cooked surface that when I fry an egg in it, the egg will not stick. And now in this case, when you use a standard wok spatula, uh, it will scratch the patina layer. And this will create a scratch mark on the surface of the wok. And when you have two metal surfaces come together, inevitably it will cause scratching. And when you use a standard steel wok spatula, it will scratch the surface of your wok. Whether the surface is constructed from cast iron, light cast iron, standard steel, or carbon steel. In the case of cast iron, because of the nature of the material, you will not notice the scratch marks. In the case of light cast iron, you will notice it because when the black resin is being worn off. In the case of carbon steel, you will notice it because of the scratch mark over the patina layer. And of course, of all the natural surfaces, a standard steel is most noticeable when it comes to scratch marks. However, this scratch mark does not result in any damage to the cooked surface. So my answer to the viewer's question is that if you have a carbon steel wok, you don't have to worry about the scratch marks at all. The standard steel wok spatula does not cause any damage to the surface of the wok, and it will not affect the seasoning of the wok. And if you use my spot seasoning method, you have no problem in creating a non-stick cooked surface. However, if your carbon steel wall have non-stick coating, then it is a different story. In this case, the standard steel spatula is actually damaging the non-stick coating. And once the non-stick coating is damaged, there's little you can do with this particular cookware. So in summary, a standard steel wall spatula will never cause any damage to cookware with natural surface. And this includes carbon steel, cast iron, light cast iron, and stainless steel. A stir frying is an integral part of my fast cooking system, uh, which includes flavor chasing, advanced prepping, stir frying, and template based cooking. And stir frying is most effective uh, when you have a wok with natural surface that you can use a standard steel wok spatula, which provides the greatest efficiency and pleasure during the stir frying process. I post a video each day uh, to demonstrate my fast cooking system so that you can cook every day. Because home cooking is not only good for your health, but it also allows you to cook the food that you love. So keep on cooking. I will see you tomorrow.